He's definitely excited. Um, I mean, of course, spending time away, he wants to be with the team, but um, had to do what was best for him. Uh, he's ready to get back on the field, and uh, we're ready to see him out there on the field. We know what type of playmaker he is. Um, the things he's done uh, while he's played has been phenomenal. So. Looking forward to get that type of talent back on the field. You know, anytime you have a guy like that, his presence around the building, uh, the excitement, the potential that he has, um, it, it's something great for our team, not just our offense. And so I'm happy about that. And so right now we're just taking baby steps. Um, you know, he's going to ease back into it, um, you know, because we've had the next man up mentality. And so we've had guys that have been forced to play, you know, a pivotal role and step up to the challenge. And so uh, we're going to have some competition, and I'm excited about that. Are you going to develop a relationship with him in the June and, you know, April, May, and June? Yeah, I've known Josh for, for a while now, um, but on the football field, uh, definitely was able to build some chemistry uh, with him, um, even just talking to him uh, throughout our time away. Uh, it was definitely key to keep him locked in. And, and get him ready for, for a big season. What kind of tandem do you think Gordon and Jarvis can make? I think it'd be very special. Uh, two uh, different skill sets, but very talented at what they do. Uh, Josh is one of the faster guys in the league and uh, one of the bigger receivers in the league. So um, he's definitely a, a, a very talented receiver. Um, you don't really run across guys like that often on teams. And of course, Jarvis, you've seen him day in and day out, how he competes and what he brings to the table. So. Looking forward to having those guys uh, on the field together. Um, puts defenses in a bind for sure. We've, We've seen a, a little bit of a different side of Todd Haley.